Hi everybody. Today we want to show you the new segmented bowl blanks that we're now offering. These CNC router blanks from Kiln Dried Wood feature a countersunk center point to make mounting with tailstock alignment really simple. Here we're gluing it to a hub with a waste block. These segmented blanks come already round so there isn't any roughing. You can just begin turning right away and quickly turn your profile shape. Since these are routered from kiln dried hardwoods, there is no open end grain to cause any tear out problems. Each section is routered on our CNC router and then glued together, forming the wavy line segments that are so unique. These are simple, fun, and really quick to turn. Sharp carbide tools provide a really nice surface finish on these. It's really smooth prior to sanding. After we've turned the outside profile, we'll give the bottom a foot and a little bit of a shape prior to parting. Now we'll start on the inside. These blanks featured a hollowed out center. So removing material is a breeze, as you can see with the simple 90 degree detailer. You can shape these as desired. The turning is really straightforward in this dry wood with no open end grain. These are fun to turn and quick to finish. Here we're using the simple scraper too to clean up any tool marks or leftover lines and also to curve around the lip and give it a final shape. Sharp carbide tools leave such a nice finish on this blank. A quick sand and then right into applying your favorite wood finish. We like to use axe, sanding, and polishing paste since it's so quick. It really brings out the wood colors and the grain and we just really love the results that we get from that. But there's many options available. Now we'll reverse our project with the vacuum chuck and reversing adapter. Now we'll use the parting tool to separate the bowl from the waste block so that we can finish the bottom. While it's still being held by the vacuum chuck, we're gonna go ahead and use the simple scraper two to remove any material left over from the waste block and flatten the bottom and finish any details around the foot of this bowl. It's simple to make light cuts on these bowls and really get a nice flat surface. The segments on this piece are just so neat, even across the bottom. A final few finished cuts with the Simple Scraper 2 and the oval cutter, and then we'll sand and finish as desired. Thanks for watching, and we really hope you guys enjoy turning these wavy lined segmented blanks.